My beautiful bride, the day has finally come. Even though our engagement was nearly a year, it seems that I was just down on my knee asking if you would love me forever on the sands of Rosemary Beach. That day you made me the happiest man that I could ever imagine, and today you will do just that again. You and that dress will be the most beautiful thing that I will <laughs> not and could not ever forget in this world. I am so happy to call you my bride, <laughs> and I would choose no other that I want to share forever with. I love you so very much. Sometimes it hurts you very soon. Love the luckiest man on earth, your groom. Bo, you are the light of my life. Sometimes I wonder how I survived life before I met you. I will never forget the day you caught my eye. I really owe that quarterback for throwing that interception to you. You are the most caring and genuine person I know. You love me in ways I couldn't even imagine. Another thing that I needed from you was to become a father figure. She looks up to you and calls you her hero. We are so blessed to have you in our lives. I cannot wait to watch you become a father of your own child. I know you will be amazing. There are so many adventures ahead of us. I would pick no other person in the world to experience them with. I love you with all that I am. I cannot wait to be your wife. And you official. <laughs> Let me welcome you all as we are here today to bear witness for Bo and Danielle as you enter into the covenant of marriage. And what the Bible tells us is that you're entering into a covenant where you are agreeing to live fully and faithfully to one another for the rest of your lives. I think I'm just ready to see Bo. All I want to do, I want to get this stuff done so I can see him. I just want to be your morning light. Danielle. I can't even begin to convert into words all of the feelings, promises, goodwill that I have for in my heart for our future. I vow to keep my covenant with you always and never stop loving you as fiercely as I do today. I promise to always ask God to remain in our minds and to guide us on how to truly love you because he is the one that only knows true love and I want that love for you. Father God, we worship you today for your goodness and for your grace demonstrated in bringing Bo and Danielle together in a holy covenant of marriage. And God, we pray that you would bless this time, you would speak to all of us as we are gathered here, and that this ceremony and this union would honor you above all. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, we pray. Amen. Bo Tyler Fischel. I have never been more sure that God designed me for you and you for me. When looking back on my life, I can see how God shaped and molded me to become the best possible wife for you. I promise to love you with all that I am. I will surrender my individual being to you and become one with you. I cannot promise that I will do everything perfectly and that I will not fail, but I do promise that I will choose to love you every single day of our lives. And the sun come up with you by my side. Riley, I know that in the past I have not allowed you to call me dad. But guess what? That all changes today. Now, allow me to make a couple more things crystal rock clear for you. <laughs> I'm going to love you with all of my heart. I'm going to protect you. <laughs> I'm going to protect you with all of my strength. I'm going to encourage you with all of my will, I'm going to push you to grow in mind, body, and spirit to become the woman as great as your mom. And most of all, I'll be your family. One that you can laugh with, cry with, have fun with, talk to, lean on, and pray with. All of these things, I promise you forever. <laughs> Bo. 
Well, Bo and Danielle, you all have exchanged vows and rings, and you are now established in the sight of God as man and wife, and you are entitled to all the responsibilities, rights, and privileges in this union. So by the power vested in me, by God and the state of Missouri, I now pronounce you husband and wife.